get ladies apparel. It didn't exist. Companies didn't want to make it. They said, big dummies, they said women will never buy apparel for the NFL. Guess what? Right now, the NFL apparel market is owned by women. And if women are not buying things for themselves, they're buying things for the guy in their life. But ladies, would you agree, you don't want just a smaller version of his t-shirt. You want something that is flattering, something that makes you feel good, shows your team support, and you demand better quality. You know, guys, guys will paint the name of their team on their bare chest at a game. You don't see women doing that. Hey, women want something a little classier and something a little more upscale. So this is from Fanatics. The material on this, it almost feels like silk. They've got that really cool air-driven sports look that they used to do with the jerseys. And then they put your favorite team on the front, but I'll let my camera come in nice and close Take a look at the top half of Jacksonville. That's done with a sequin print. So it looks like bling. And then you've got your favorite team logo on the chest, and then they've got the lace design top. I think these are remarkable. These are all done in 100% polyester, easy care, uh, for the ladies, I, real quick, I'll tell you, we are sold out of the 49ers, the Bengals, the Bills, the Browns, the Chiefs, the Dolphins, Saints, and also the Eagles. I know that I had one left when I left my dressing room to come on the air. One of them left for Dallas in a size medium. When these are gone, they're gone. Dallas is now gone. All right, let me bring in Donald. Donald Schuler Jr. This guy was an athlete. Uh, he's a life coach, man. This guy, he, he can get anybody motivated. I, I need locker room talk in my own house sometimes. <laughs> How you doing, bud? What's up, my brother? Happy holidays, man. Same to you. Good to see you. Uh, man. You, you and I don't get to talk about ladies' apparel very often, but this is a right. winner. This is one that I think anybody will support especially with the number of teams that we still have in inventory. Let me tell you something, man. Like, my family, the ladies in my family, they are hounding me for these pieces, brother. And like you said, of course, the fly, Eagles, fly, E-A-G-L-E-S. You guys know the rest. Eagles. Although we were kind of sold out of these. Yeah. So, but that's okay. But we have other teams fully in stock at the moment. And, uh, again, Fanatics, we've been in the – apparel industry since the early 90s yeah and uh, we've been we've been kicking it real hard <laughs> for sure fanatics <laughs> was one of the very first big brand names in nfl licensing to, yep. to commit to making women's apparel yeah, Be because there yeah. was this ridiculous thought process that women wouldn't wear it and yet my wife is actually much more vocal during the game uh i I'm worried about personal injury between Dallas <laughs> this weekend. Listen, personal <laughs> safety is a must <laughs> with the ladies who are super enthused, man. You know, like you said, I don't know who said that, you know, sports apparel was only for men. And yeah. that's really, it was super frustrating. Like you said, like the ladies want to look cool, want to be sporty as well, sporty and classy. As you can see, I mean, we have the lace here, the, which is like a drawstring. And uh, the mesh, which is breathable and 100% polyester. Yep. So just in case everybody's sweating and, and jumping around and doing all types of stuff, you can still stay cool. And I think another key part, just with ladies' apparel, is the slimming silhouette right here. I mean, on the sides, it's, it's nice and tight, but it flows out at the bottom. Yeah, just they kind of anybody... color blocked the side yeah. seams. Uh, yeah. and, and it really, I mean, that's a nice touch. It's a little bit different. But it does give a nice float. I'm going to start doing that with dress shirts. <laughs> Think that'll help? Listen, give it a, give it a little flow at the bottom, <laughs> just in case too many hamburgers or hot dogs yeah. at the game. And that's okay. 
Donald, good. when when the game starts at my house, uh, I just I come down from my office. I sit down. Usually, if listen, if it's going to be a Hallmark movie, uh, <laughs> it's, my wife we we kind of snuggle on the couch. Football yeah, yeah, game. Yeah. She's got her side of the couch. I got my own. I'll come down with whatever I'm wearing. She yeah. she looks like she's she's a wide receiver for the Eagles. She's got the T-shirt. She's got the 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 uh, leggings. She's got everything is Eagles apparel. She dresses for the TV show. And man, <laughs> she's I, ready to go in, huh? Put me she, in. Come. Yes, and I'm. I think she could do. My wife hit me so hard in the arm last week. As if I'm the one who threw the two interceptions. Uh, I had nothing to do with those interceptions. She called you know out what? Jalen Hurt's name and then hurt me. That's not fair. And bop you. She did. <laughs> <laughs> and, and if I and if I if I wins, she just kind of goes, come on. She's stronger right, right. than me. <laughs> women, Listen, women man. are as big as sports fans, sometimes more so. You yeah. saw Ashley earlier. She oh. Watching a football game with her would be a trip because she's yeah, so into it. I love it. Yeah, You've got like, great like apparel. You space. Yeah, good stuff. <laughs> Donald, uh, happy holidays to you, to your family. Uh, you're a new addition to the team this year, and we got the draft pick, man. We got the first oh. round. Welcome. Great to have you here. Thank you, brother. Happy holidays. See you soon. Do, 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 do. I think this is the coolest thing.